What is up, Koi family? Welcome back to the Jabby Koi channel. I'm Achara Kirk, joined by Steph Zabra. Hello. What up, bra? What up? We are checking out a filter copy video today. This is called Filter Copy Elder Sister versus Younger Sister. You have a sister. Yeah, we're twins, so it's kind of in between. I was born first. Oh, I okay. really do think my mom calls me her eldest daughter. Like, so I, like I'm the big sister. You carry the elder sister energy. Big time. Yeah. She's such a baby. Okay. And she's having a baby, and we're like, that's why she's going to be such a good mom because she's still a baby and she'll know everything the baby wants. <laughs> Perfect. I am also an elder sister. Let's see how accurate this is. Yeah. So you guys, if you haven't already, please subscribe to the channel. Click that bell icon for all notifications so you know whenever we drop a new video and upvote this video if you are enjoying what you're watching. All right. Entertain me. <laughs> Filter copy. Why is your hair on my side of the bed? <laughs> uh oh. Move it. Why is your blanket on my side of the bed? Move it. Why are you breathing on my side of the bed? Move it. Why are you on my side of the bed? Uh, Aww. Wait, did you ever share a bed with your sister? Not a bed, but a room. Oh, okay. Yeah, we had like two little twin beds. We all take naps together like we would have, but yeah. never shared a bed. Did you? I, yeah, I feel this is like a very super Asian thing, but like, yeah, I, I shared a bed with my sister and some of those things, yes, but my sister was a blanket hog. We weren't so organized that we had two separate blankets. Mm -hmm. It was like one and she was like a real blanket hog because she kind of get it underneath her and as then well. Turn. Yeah. yeah, she was also like a hugger. She runs hot and so I'd always be like get off me you're a leech <laughs> stop there were some nice moments too I used to like stroke her hair to help her sleep and stuff uh, yeah I miss those days a glass water last week last week I came here oh what happened 14th November 2016 geezer not a list <laughs> Okay. Wow. Petty LaBelle. <laughs> Stop. 17th no. March 2012, Penkiri. 4th April 2008, Compass Box. 26th wow. July 1996, when I was in the I need to get one of those for Jabby. You are in my room, right? One minute, don't worry. Don't worry, don't worry. I was first, okay? How many hours are you? Even I want to watch you, bud. One minute. When you are ready, you will be ready. I am going to go with mom and dad. Mom, let's go to the movie. No, son. Papa, let's go to the movie. No, it's very important. Wow. So nice. Bro, chal na cake banata hai YouTube mein ek awesome recipe mili hai dek. Nee nee nee, I'm not baking it. It means you watching and me doing all the work. No, main hi kam karungi sab. Tu bas thoda sa help kar dena. Oh my god. Ab main da dal de. Bas bas bas. Kab dal diya? Haan. I am her. I am her. I am literally her. Both my my older sister and my younger sister, they love to cook. I love to cook as well. But also if someone else is cooking, I love to watch. So like there have definitely been situations where I'll just kind of be like hanging out. But my, my older sister has sussed it out. She'll immediately assign me tasks to do. She'll be like, sous chef. And I'm like, Yes, chef. Uh, aye, aye. Aye. <laughs> what do I need to do? Because she knows if she doesn't tell me, I'll just stand there and like chit chat. Yeah. Like, oh, what's going on? I'm a talker too. My sister <laughs> refuses to cook. My mom has cooked for us our whole lives. I've always watched and cooked with her. I've always had an interest in it. Uh -huh. She's never had a single interest at all. And then luckily she married someone who cooks. Oh, good for her. She'll do some of it. Like, she'll make, like, smoothies, things like that. Like, she cooks like a dad. Like, oh, you need eggs? I got it. I got, you got eggs. Cere you need yeah. cereal? Say less. I got the cereal. <laughs> but, like, anything, like, that takes preparation, no. Nope. She's sitting, watching, <laughs> judging. <laughs> judging. <laughs> Tasting everything and being like, hmm, more salt needed. Yeah. <laughs> like, shut up. You didn't do anything. What's going on? She... Color combination day. Palak paneer lagri hai. Oh no. 
ये तो ठीक है Yuck. What's wrong? It's very Christmassy. Okay. I like this combo. Hmm. Not bad. It's cute. Yeah, sarcastic. Why are you doing this? Straight, straight. Don't feel good. Actually, you're right. Why are you wearing corn pants? Stupid. Are you? But I was serious. Who is talking to you? Boyfriend, yeah. Yeah. Are you? I'm your sister. Our boyfriend. No, no, so so that's not how it happened. I, no, so, yeah, have you guys kissed or something? Well, no, I'm your sister, no. Actually, yeah. And his lips were so soft. We were on his couch and he pulled me closer. His hands were on my waist. Caressed my face. Yeah, I do. Yeah, it's good. Tell me. Tell me. I'm your sister. It's a fine line. Yeah, it's a fine line. It's a fine line, definitely. Like I was always very excited when my sister would be like, "Oh, I started dating someone." I'd be like, "How's it going?" Blah, blah, blah. I'm like, no. "Stop at the details." I'm a full grown adult doing full grown adult things, and the moment my sister wants to talk about adult things, like how she got pregnant, right? Yeah. I'm like, no, I'm. I get it. You got pregnant. I don't need to hear details <laughs> of like when you stopped birth control. <laughs> yeah. Chill. Well, actually, I do ask those questions, <laughs> but then, like, when it starts to get a little bit too detailed, I'm like, whoa, whoa, whoa. I'm like, cool. I'm so glad you guys have a healthy relationship. You may stop. Also, <laughs> I don't need to know everything about the person that she's with. You know what I mean? No. Like, I can know about her. I don't need to know about them. Yes. Don't need to. Don't. don't. I can just see the image with clothes. Hey, Papa, it's very bad. Please, come home. We'll have to take you to the hospital. What? Yeah, I'm calling the doctor. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, fine. Come on, come on. I'm also coming. Where is Papa? Is he all right? He's sleeping. Heart attack. I thought the doctor said that it's acidity. Acidity? <laughs> God. I got so scared. Oh no, don't make me cry. Papa, when are you saying that you don't want to go to the punch? And we've always been too busy. It's their birthday. And the hair. Yeah. And you know what? They'll have to eat the gobi. It always gives him acidity. I love you. Oh, stop. I love you too. Chill, pani leke. Hey guys, I am Ishaswini Daima. I'm Jayanti Chakravarti, and I hope, hope you, you like the video. No, I was supposed to say that. Supposed to say the keep watching filter copy. I say if you like the video, you like, subscribe, and share. No, I was supposed to say that because I'm the elder one. So you know, I'm supposed to start. Yeah, but they were just asking the elder one says no. They're good together. Very cute. Yeah, very very cute. A lot of the the squabbling and stuff like that. Definitely, especially when we were younger, my sister and I it was very much that. Like we have a four year age gap, but we were pretty close because anytime I wanted to go on a sleepover at my friend's house, my mom would be like, cool. Bring your sister, and I'm like, why? She's literally my shadow, mom. You can't go if she can't go. Oh my god, fine. So like, she was always around, and while that was nice sometimes, a lot of the time when I was younger, I was just like, please, just leave me alone. Can you find your own friends? But she always got along with my friends better. Or I think she was maybe more of an old soul, mm -hmm. so she just got along with people who were older. And then again, like in middle school and high school and stuff, she was always just hanging around. And then eventually we became best friends. Isn't that weird when that happens? Yeah. The funniest thing, what I thought they captured well, is how rude and annoying you can be to your siblings. You would never talk to anyone else like that. Yeah. For some reason, there's this unspoken agreement that you know that it's not serious. Like, I yeah. would never take it personal because it's my sister. She'll be like, you're being so annoying right now. Or like, Seth, your hair is so ugly the way it is. And I'll be like, <laughs> oh, really? Like, but anyone else would be like, who are you? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, exactly. And like, I love how they made it like kind of sweet at the end. And so they're yeah. actually like, I love you.
you. Achara was like so quickly gonna go from laughing to crying. Yeah. I was looking at the camera like, Achara. <laughs> I was like, no. Whenever it's something to do with family, it's like my waterworks get switched on so quickly. If it's like mom, dad, sister, whatever, I'm immediately like, I'm gonna cry. Because I had this thought that ran through my mind and it's something that crosses my mind every now and then. It makes me very appreciative to have a sibling. It's that I'm so fortunate. I know that there is one person who for the rest of my life knows me, who has known me since I was really small, who loves me unconditionally, who will always be there for me. And when my mom and dad are gone and hopefully like everything goes in the natural order of things, right? Providing that happens when my mom and dad are gone, I will have another person who will remember them and I can share that with them. And so like, that makes me really sad. <laughs> that you get to talk yeah. to that person. I yeah. know, I know it's true. Like when you have a close knit family, my sibling and I talk about all the time where like anytime like anything gets brought up with the idea of our parents not being here we're like okay shut up we can't even think about <laughs> yeah. it yeah <laughs> <Just> yeah <shut up. laughs> yeah but it does it makes me really appreciative to to have a close family that I know will always have my back no matter how annoying I might find them at, at any point in time because like yeah no my, no my siblings are annoying. annoying yeah they're truly the best <laughs> if you don't have someone that you're close to fam- blood really is just not you can find your own family that you yeah. call your loved ones but when you do have siblings you love it is a really special bond you're like yeah. oh that's that's really yeah the family and it is a bond where i've definitely felt especially when we were younger my younger sister used to get bullied a fair bit because she was a little bit chubby it was my sister too yeah people would bully her and i would be like who did it i'm gonna do you want me to go I'll go, I'll fight for you. I will literally yeah. like beat someone up. Mm-hmm. Tell me who it is. She's like, no, no, yeah. it's okay. I'm like, just let me know. Yeah, just say the word. <laughs> I'm there. Who wants this? I would say, you want this knuckle sandwich? That was one of my go-tos. Yeah, it was one of your go-tos. <laughs> yeah, yeah. That's why you need a like a big sister, big sister energy <laughs> yeah. around. Yeah. Super protective. Yeah. Anyway, you guys share your stories in the comments below. Yeah, we'll catch you next time. I'm Achara Cook. This is Steph Sabra. Ciao.